Hey, what's up y'all? I'm Sensible Sign and welcome back to another video. So, um, yeah, there have been quite a few updates since the last uh, video I made. Um, let me just get my items really quick. So the first one I really want to talk about is, where is that little sucker? There he is. There's a new hero and it's an egg. It's the Unripe Hatchling. And that's what it looks like. It's a little baby dragon. Um, I'm trying to level this guy up to the max so that I could uh, see if he's a good hero or not. Right now I'm just leveling up his skills. So uh, let's just read his ability. So the first ability is called the Flame Spin. So from the start of the battle, Unripe remains in her eggshell until... So it's a girl. Um, Unripe remains in her eggshell until... The shell 0.5 HP strength depletes to zero. Uh, when active, Unripe will emerge from the eggshell and spin attack the closest enemies with waves of fire dealing that much magic damage and knock them back a distance of 200. Okay, so this to me already, right now sounds kind of like a Unicorgi attack. You know how Unicorgi does a tail spin? Sounds something like that, but it pushes the enemy back, so that's kind of cool. Um, this one might actually be kind of cool for, um, for the new lineups that are coming up. Because people usually have, like, a Unicorgi charge at you. And you get hit a lot at the beginning. But this hero right here is going to remain in its shell. Um, yeah, this, this hero right here is going to remain in its shell until its shell is broken. And then it's going to attack. So I think this might be one of the, uh, new heroes that's going to st uh, start taking down the, uh, lineups that are currently winning. So uh, I'm looking forward to see if this one will make it into the top uh, five heroes for Fight Pit. All right, so then the next ability, the green ability, is called Burning Egg Bamp. Burning Egg Bamp. Okay, I wonder what that is. So it says, when hatching from her eggshell, unwrap leashes an explosion of light, blinding all hit enemies for that many seconds, I'm assuming, and dealing that much magic damage to all enemies with its 400 blast range okay so that means that anybody within range is going to be hit with a magic blast and they're going to be blinded uh, again that's pretty cool it, and all this happens i guess at the same time as the the flame spin or soon after the next one's called shh so it removes all debuff when unripe falls asleep and heals herself that much every second for four seconds in her if her enemy attack disrupts her sleep, she'll react by firing a ball of light dealing that much uh, true damage to the nearest enemy. Okay. And then parental love. Allies receive a that much critical damage buff while on a... This hero sounds like it's going to be awesome. So by the looks of it, yeah, it's it's this looks like it's going to be a really good hero to have as your uh, as a defense. Um hero because all of its abilities are actually really useful with the current lineups that people are using i'm actually curious as to if any of the top fight pit players are using her let's see um so they're still using that whole um freaking karaoke king combo so it's a fairly new hero so i wouldn't uh it wouldn't surprise me if in a few days i look back up here and it's one of the top five uh heroes in fight pit so i actually think that's going to be one of the better heroes uh, as far as defense goes and uh and support i guess because it's a support hero right let me see by roll we have our defense heroes followed by your damage heroes support yeah it's a support hero so uh yeah i actually think this support hero is going to be pretty cool so um, I'm actually going to try to level her up to the cyan color as soon as possible to uh, to kind of assess whether she's worth it or not. So that's that's going to be my goal for the next few weeks, I guess. Or I suppose I should say. All right. Um, the next thing I want to talk about, which somebody mentioned in a comment on another one of my videos is... Oops, let's go with power. Um, that... King, King Caillou got a new ability. What? I haven't unlocked it yet. Yeah, King Caillou hasn't has a new ability which I have not unlocked yet. But um, 
reduces incoming range attack damage by that much amount and achieves heavy tag on enemy enemies damage by basic attack okay so i'm not too sure how good this ability is i haven't had time to unlock it i'm pretty close though i could probably unlock it on this video if i wanted to um and then the other ability that i haven't been able to check if it's good or not is this one because it's freaking annoying like i almost had it done but you can only sacrifice one item a day and if you don't sacrifice one the next day it resets i already had it at four out of five but i forgot to log in that was around the time when the when the server was well i mean when i couldn't download the game and uh and yeah so it reset me back to zero so i don't even want to figure out if his ability is good or not i guess i'll leave that for way later in the future so right now my main goal is to get the uh the unripe hatchling to a cyan color in the max level so yeah so that, that's uh that's basically what i wanted to talk about guys uh i want your guys opinion on the unripe hatchling and if your server has it because i know some people's servers don't have the heroes so i mean don't have the heroes that i have on mine so let me know if uh if you guys have this hero on your server and if you're partaking in the contest to get the hero because if you take part in the contest you get soul stones for the hero you only need 10 to uh to unlock her and if you place you get some pretty good amount of soul stones for her so right now i'm at 15 but i think i want to shoot for uh maybe 50 soul stones that, that's kind of what i'm shooting for in this contest so yeah the contest requires diamonds and energy and fight pit with those heroes um so yeah let me know what you guys think about the new hero um i'm curious if you guys think she's gonna be one of the top fives as well and actually you know what i'm gonna show you what she looks like when she's fighting so i'm gonna go back a few because i don't think she could handle at her current level something that high so let's see I'll take all these guys off and i'm gonna put her only and see how she does I don't even know what she does, but let's see. I haven't actually ever used her until right now. This is the first time I see her in battle. Well, this is going to be bad. <laughs> I don't think they're ever going to break her shell. Oh, man. Sorry about that, guys. That happens every video. Yeah, this might take a while. All right, you know what? I'm gonna retreat, and I'm gonna go to a bit higher level. Let's try that one. All right, this looks more reasonable. I just wanna see how it looks like when the shell breaks and what she does. That's it. Okay, the description sounded a lot more impressive. All right, so this is definitely not a fighting hero. Um, yeah, that was pretty disappointing. But again, I do have her at a very, very, very low level. So I want to see what she does once she has a decent level. And uh, just based on that, guys, let me know what you guys think of this new hero. And uh, again, same question applies. Do you guys think it's going to be one of the top five? Uh, you think it's worth it for me to level her up um yeah let me know all that in the comments uh, if you guys like watching my dragon soul videos don't forget to give uh give the video a like uh if you guys like my videos in general make sure you subscribe and i will see you guys in a new video pretty soon uh, i'm hoping to make a guide or something I, I, i'm actually thinking of making a runescape video next so uh stay tuned for that if you guys play runescape so that all being said thank you guys all for watching and I will see you guys in a new video pretty soon. Peace out, y'all.